See, I could be running through this area with a big giant robot dog. But my robot dog had to have a fucking only 800 armor. So we got really ripped off with that. Okay. We have heavy armor dudes here? Hey. You can't see me. He can't see me! Stop trying to look around the edge! Stop! Stop it! Stop it! You don't see anything! Yeah, there's a dead body. Yeah, there's someone slightly crouched near the dead body. But that doesn't mean anything. God, there's like three of them, too. Actually, that one's a normal guy. You can tell, because he doesn't have, like, dual... dual wielding going on. Bring it on, sucker. Turn around, you die. Oh, hi! Have a hatchet. In your leg. Okay. Well, we successfully snuck through this area. And you know what that means. Now I have to kill everybody else. Oh, they know. Hold on, we're swapping things around. There. Okay. Flop. <laughs> Headshot! Where's the other heavy armor dude? Is that like locked into position? No, it's not! It just hadn't been activated yet. Oh! Damn! Wow. Uh... That died a lot quicker than I thought he was going to. A single shot. He didn't even fully charge up my shot, I just fired once. Huh. If my dog had made it down there, we could have gotten so much armor for it. Oh well. The exit here is this tiny little hole, so my dog would have had to have stopped eventually. Uh... This doesn't seem right. I think I'm supposed to swim down there. Alright, what do we got down in this area? A few different areas to explore. Momentum's kind of waning, but that's fine. Actually, want to keep my gun out. Ah, uh, fine. We'll keep my dual machine guns out. Or my sh machine pistols. No, not machine pistol, just normal pistol and suppressor. Damn it. So, if I do run into a person while sneaking around, we can kill it pretty quickly. How many uh, stealth kills do I need to get to speed up my crouch? We need four more stealth kills. Yeah, we're really slow on that. In comparison to, like, the hundreds of other kills we've gotten? Christ. Okay, we got people up here. Just stay turned around, man. Thank you! I need my perk upgrades! I'm sad that the, even maxed out, the overcharge health reduction thing is still pretty... Still pretty fast to drain. Ah! 
Honestly, I probably could have been seen by this guy, and, uh... I think he was the only one left before this door. Yep, see? Exit level. Anya. Come in, Anya. Do you read? William, I read you. What's happening? You okay there, darling? I'm doing... Uh, fine. <laughs> I'm trying to regroup with Fergus. I've contacted Grace. The U-boat is on its way in, and we are on our way to Lakeview District. Listen, don't do anything reckless. You stay safe. I'll be fine. Anya out. Horton, what's your status? Round up the last of the people and fixing to leave. Now make your way to the Lakeview District. Bring everyone. We're getting a ride out of here. Well, Billy, that might be a fine idea in theory, but I reckon all them Nazis between here and yonder might slow us down dearly. Wager I can get their attention. Kill them all. That's the objective. Next stop, Lakeview District. Oh, yep, he fucking saw me drop. That son of a bitch. You can't say you're blocking my line of sight. I mean, if he's facing away from you, of course he can't see it. Yeah, wow, that guy got fucked. I want to see what happens if I shoot one of these Nazis with a fully charged shot. I missed. Well, unfortunately, we're out of ammo. Blasco, bogged down by Nazis here. Boss us top side of the. Get on ya! What's the name of this fucking place? We're on the roof of the Lakeview apartment building. Think we can hold out for a wee bit, but these Nazis keep coming like torrential diarrhea. Terror Billy, we've met up with your people on the roof of the Lakeview apartment building. That ride of yours better get here soon, because we won't hold out much longer. Hey, Conrad, you up and went on a tropical cruise with our boat? The Nazis are fucking killing us here! Fergus, I read. Sorry, it's being held up. Working to resolve the problem. What, what the fuck is the problem? Is it the, the hundreds of mines? Or are you being attacked? Did they detect, detect, did they, that? Did they detect our boat? What's going on over there? I guess we'll find out soon enough. That was pretty quick. It was just basically a giant mech and we killed it in two charged shots. Holy shit. Good to know. Those things aren't really, uh... Those things aren't gonna stand against us that well anymore. I mean, they didn't do a good job anyways. More sewers. Huh. But don't you like swimming in sewers constantly, Blaskovich? Blaskowicz. They say both, so honestly, I guess it doesn't really matter. Whoop. Ah! Jesus! Alligators in the sewers? Are you kidding me? Okay, game devs. <laughs> Keep I doing see what, you what you're there. doing, Anya! If we're going down, we're going down fighting! Grace! We need evacuation now! I was about to say, uh, I'm not even visible. How are they- why are they detecting me? No, this is just one of those segments. Oh, I'm dead. Jesus Christ, Grace, that was cool. <laughs> okay. So, uh, fuck this guy. Can't allow them to stay alive longer than, uh, necessary. Jesus Christ, Chris, I was close. So you is that ours? Conrad, yeah, okay. But you're the most lovable Conrad I've ever laid eyes on. Fergus, Anya, help everyone get on board the U-boat. The Nazis will regroup and attack. Hurry up. Blaskowitz, get your ass up on the Lakeview apartment building roof and climb on board the U-boat. We've spotted the Altamurtzer on the radar. It'll be here any minute. Haul ass! The radar? Jesus! Okay, that, yeah, that, that's gonna be pretty close. Uh, give me a second. I'm trying to get health and armor and things like that because, uh, while I'm running up to you guys, the Nazis are shooting the shit out of me. Health, 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 health. Ooh, an upgrade kit. That's good to get. I'm just randomly exploring. Is someone shooting at me? Or is it my people on the boat? I don't even know.
Oh. Alright. I just go down the street straight to the boat. Or the U-boat. I was hoping that the first person we saw was going to be the officer and that I could like try and stealth kill them, but no, they, they know about me. They know what's up. Oh, you've revealed your position! Oh, it was a trap! It was actually just a light! I don't know if a dog was behind us or what? I heard just like a It was a dog, I was right. Fucking damn it. <laughs> Thankfully I turned around and just immediately mowed it down. Angry dog versus giant shotgun heavy weapon. Well, this is just bad. Ow. Hold on. He's gonna have friends. Blazkowicz, all of the evacuees are on board, We're but not. we can't leave. Props are stuck in the mud. We're stranded. And the outsmercher is incoming. If it gets here before we bail, we are fucked. I say it's time to ready the nuclear cannon. What are you talking about, Fergus? I figure the shockwave from the atom bomb could push the boat out to sea. Now that's the stupidest fucking plan I have ever heard. Set. Well, for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. Blazkowicz. Hop on the nuclear cannon and fire it to maximum distance. I just hope it's far enough away from us not to rupture the hull. <laughs> That's a hell of a plan, but all right, sure. We'll launch a nuke in New Orleans. It's not like there are people left here anyways. Yeah, I'm glad there- oh, never mind. I was gonna say I'm glad there's no one left because I have like no health. I guess that was not a stealth kill. <laughs> All right. Let's go launch a nuke. Oh shit. Can we launch a nuke just straight in that? I mean, we died. You but have to fire God. now, Blastwitz. Now. I'm impressed the Asmazer was able to stay, stay in the air after that. Got it. Looks like the Ausmercer lost track of us. Clear skies on the scope. Friar Angle commands them now. Using the Taunt Terrace. But in the way back, the Ausmercer would roam from city to city, crushing any resistance. And if we ignite a revolt, you can be sure the Ausmercer would swoop in, put an end to it, break and say hell's bells. Are we gonna start this revolution? We need to put an end to the Aus Mercer firstly. So then we mount a surprise attack, conquer the Aus Mercer, and use it against the Nazis. Well, the Aus Mercer is protected by an automated security system called Odin. Seen it when I was up there. We'll hijack the system, find the Odin codes, and disable the fucking thing. Yeah, but that kind of information is a top military secret. Only the Oberkommando is privy to it. Sounds like your basic Nazi military facility infill. I'll break into the Ober Commando and steal the information off their, uh, computing machines. Not a problem. Except for the fact that the Ober Commando is now on fucking planet Venus. What? Ever since you obliterated the Ober Commando at Roswell with that nuclear bloody warhead, the Nazis have been trying to shove the shite back into the horse. So, they moved the Ober Commando to another fucking planet to keep it away from us. All of their top brass, all their top military secrets have been moved to a fully secured base on Venus. Venus. There is no way you are making it to Venus, sunshine. I don't care how mighty your arsenal or how much fucking manpower, there is not a hope in hell you can bypass all that security. Yeah. 
Not with that attitude. Except maybe there is. In two days, final auditions for the role of the infamous terrorist William Terribilly Glaskowitz take place on the enigmatic Aristat habitat on Venus. One of the hopeful actors is Jules Redfield, here getting a snack from his favorite milkshake bar in his hometown of Eagles, California. What you thinking, Anya? William and I are going for milkshakes. <laughs> I was wondering that. I didn't say bring it up, but I was wondering if we were going to end up trying to fake that we are ourselves. His papers are all in his glove box. Yeah. What about him? Well, is he a Nazi? You a Nazi fella? <laughs> Can't even tell no more. <laughs> How I look. Like a walrus. Don't forget your luggage. Remember, you are Jules Redfield, professional actor, traveling to Venus to audition for the part of William Joseph Blaskovich. Now, you are summoned by personal invitation, so security should be minimal. Break a leg. What if they ask me about my previous performances? Mr. Redfield? Mr. You, Sir Redfield? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. That's me. I'm Helena, the director of this film. Apologies for the long journey, but my producer favors a safe location and has an affinity for dramatic settings. Uh, come. Oh, uh, I'm on my luggage. Someone will bring it for you. Come, come. Welcome. Welcome to the audition, Mr. Redfield. Now that you're all here, I ask you to prepare yourselves. You must be off book for this audition, so be sure to memorize your lines before the producer gets here. He has a volatile disposition, so be careful what you say and do in his presence. Mr. Redfield, I can't stress enough how important it is you learn these lines by heart. Your script is on the chair. Oh, jeez. I will be with you shortly. Can't blow my cover. Better keep a low profile. Leave the pretend acting for those so inclined. Yeah, okay. But first, I gotta see what's going on here. Short list for this? Nah, man. Casting director saw me on a mystery show. Thought I had the right face. This is exciting, man. Venus and all? Yeah, no, it's a little weird, though, no? Why Venus? What's wrong with L.A.? Producer gotta be a real big cheese. Muhammad must go to the mountain type deal. Yeah. Any stage experience? What was your name? Roland, was it? Ronald. Ronald. Nah. I used to do uh, broadcasts uh, when I was younger. Nowadays, it's all pictures and TV. Yeah, I thought about doing film acting, but I just love the theater. You know, I'm not sure I even want this role. It's not like real acting unless you're on a stage in front of a live audience. You know what I mean. Sure thing, Chief. Sure thing, Chief. He just said he did broadcasts. Unbelievable. <laughs> oh, what about you? What's your deal? Your dirty race. I will murder your dirty race, too. Oh, come on, Johnny. Hey. <laughs> Better than this. <clears throat> I'll murder... Oh. <clears throat> I will murder your dirty race. Oh, Jesus, you moron. I feel offended. You guys gotta nail this the road down awesome. a little bit more. Venus, can you believe it? Yeah, I can believe it. Uh, there's really not much to look at in Venus, but, you know, whatever. Hold on. Hey, guys, don't mind me. There's just a gold thing back here. All right. What is her name? Lady Helene. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Helene. Let's go learn our lines and hope that we don't forget them. Write down the lines. How am I supposed to remember this shit? I'm gonna write this down. Hold on. Uh, the End of All Evil by A.H. English translation. But they are too late. The bomb in the dining hall explodes, killing every child inside mercilessly. Every child! inside are you kidding me oh my god they're gonna paint me so bad the camera moves in on blondie who stops outside the orphanage the dog lowers her head and whimpers she realizes that she is too late and that many innocent german lives have been lost blondie i guess is a dog 
The camera pans over the chaos and death which suffuses the classroom. We zoom in on the lone dark shape of William Blaskowitz, the child murderer, looming over the dozens of tiny scattered bodies. Sunlight seeps through the gray Venetian blinds, their shadows imprisoning our evil antagonist figuratively. Ava, the school teacher, looks up from the murdered eight-year-old girl she's cradling. She is weeping. Ava, dramatically weeping. A cold-blooded terrorist, that is what you are! E. Blaskovich, with evil contempt. And you're a Nazi whore! You monster! What are you going to do to me? I will rape and murder you! So many German innocent lives you have killed, but the German race will rise again. I will murder your dirty race too. <laughs> places, places, quickly. <coughs> Hide Hitler. Hide Hitler. Hitler. And you get up and say hell Hitler. Dead, dead, dead. Well, he doesn't notice. Oh yes, makeup. Good. <laughs> das ist magisch. Ja. Magisch. Magisch. <lacht> Schauspieler, geschult in der Kunst der Verkleidung und der Täuschung. Ja. Ähnlich wie Spione. Vielleicht ist er ein Spion unter Ihnen. Sie haben sicher alle mein Buch gelesen. Oh yes, mein Führer. And my children have read it too. I loved it, Mr. Hitler. Super good. Mr. Mr. Hitler. Wenn Sie mich ansprechen, sagen Sie mein Führer. Verstanden? Haben Sie keinen Respekt vor Autorität? Ihre Worte gewähren Einblick in einen höchst verraterischen Geist. I am so sorry, mein Führer. Sind Sie denn ein Idiot? No, mein Führer. Sind Sie ein verkleideter Schurke, ein Jude? Ein verräterischer Jude? No, no, mein Führer. I'm... I'm from Arizona. Oh! Well, there goes the guy from Arizona. A little less competition. Yeah, they come in immer wieder. Wölfe im Schafspelz. Konspirierende, lügende, niederträchtige Juden. Ich erkenne sie schon von weitem. He's gonna fucking take a big Yeah, all right. Yeah, all right, Hitler. Wenn Sie mein Buch gelesen haben, wissen Sie, dass ich die Wahrheit kenne. Und wer die Wahrheit auf seiner Seite hat, der gewinnt immer. So konnte ich die Welt von den Juden reinigen und so konnte ich die minderwertigen Kommunisten in die Knie zwingen. Oh, so ging das. Ich habe ihn vernichtet. William. Oh. Josef Blatzkowitsch. Helene, mein absolutes Meisterstück, das Jahrhundert Epos und mein künstlerisches Erbe. Wer mein Drehbuch liest, der wird die zahllosen Stunden zu schätzen wissen, die ich aufgewendet habe, damit jede Szene, jeder Zeile, jeder Silber fehlerfrei ist. Bravo, mein Führer, bravo! I like how BJ's just in there, just being all stoic after all this shit. Um Gottes Willen. Goddamn. Yeah, they're, they're definitely making Hitler just... Fuck, I'm just disgusting as all hell here. Mutti. Mir ist so kalt. 
Fuck. <coughs> Fuck. Sie. Sie spielen die Szene. You Elena. play the scene. <laughs> Zusammen mit Ihnen. Oh boy. A cold-blooded terrorist. That is what you are. What the hell did I write? And you're a Nazi whore! And you're a nice woman. <laughs> you're a fuzzy worm! Oh my god, no, you're, you're a Nazi whore. And you are a Nazi whore. You monster! What are you going to do to me? Uh... <laughs> I will save and marry you. I, I do these, but then we just get shot. Oh my god. I want to... I wish he would read it with a little bit more emphasis, but he's just going to be like, uh, I don't know how to act, so I am just going to read this. I will rape and murder you. So many German innocent lives you have killed, but the German race will rise again! Shit. <laughs> I, I will massacre your damn people too, I will murder your dirty race too, it's I will murder your dirty race too. I will murder your dirty race, too. <coughs> the you got the words right. But you do not seem you do not seem to have any grasp of the psychology of a man like William Joseph Blaskovich. Joseph Blaskovich. How can you be what you do not understand? See. Spielen Sie die Rolle. Füllen Sie, füllen Sie, füllen Sie die Rolle. Yes, become the part, man. Old blooded terrorist. That is what you are. And you're a Nazi whore. You monster. What are you going to do to me? I will rape you. And I will murder you. So many German innocent lives you have killed. But the German race. We rise again. And I will murder your dirty race, too. No, oh, nice, nice. He actually puts some emphasis on things. Sie könnten von ihm lernen. Ich gebe ihnen, was sie brauchen, um den Geist dieses Irren zu verstehen. Dieses no. What about the uh, psychology of me? In und I knew him inside and out. It's because I knew him so well, I was able to stop, capture, and bring him to justice. Oh, mein Gott. Mein Gott, habe ich Hunger. William Joseph Blatzkowitsch. That's me. Aufgewachsen in Mesquite, Texas. Mischlingskind eines Verkäufers und einer polnischen Jüdin. Die Mutter wurde vom Vater ausgeliefert, starb in einem Vernichtungslager in She Neumexico. Died? As an adult, his intellectual capacity remained on a child's level. Look at that! Holy shit! Also, they sliced up my body. Those fucking assholes. Machen Sie weiter. Ich bin müde. Aspirants, as you know, this role is very physical. William Josef Bloskowitz was not a man of intellect, he was a man of action! Ugh. The scene takes place right before the scene you did earlier. Bloskowitz is about to plant the bombs that will massacre the German children in the orphanage. But first, he must eliminate the brave soldier standing guard outside the school in a brutal fight scene. Mr. Llewellyn Irving? Llewellyn Ewing. Yeah. Why don't you start? Good luck in there, man! Each improvise a fight sequence. And uh, once the guard is eliminated, uh, you finish the scene by reading the lines from the cue card, exactly as written. Places and action! I'm bleeding. I, I, I need to take a break. Line, please. Yeah, I, I need a doctor. Line. 
Your bravery is no match for a Neanderthal like myself. Besides, I only know how to fight in a dirty manner. And now, to kill all the innocent children, Germany's future. Ha 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 ha, will I? Oh, God. Ah! <laughs> oh, oh shit! Oh god! Oh, oh fuck! You shot him for how bad that was. Uh. Please. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna kick this guy's ass. We're gonna brutalize this guy. Yeah. After all, he's just a Nazi. Hitler. Oh. Uh. Ah! <laughs> you can kick Hitler in the face. <laughs> I saw the button. I'm like, well, do I help him up or something? Nephew, would you step into the box? Yeah. Yeah. Does it actually say Neanderthal? If he doesn't, if he isn't a thinking type, how would he know that he's a Neanderthal? Ugh. All right. I had the good luck, Bulzer. Oh, you're gonna have a bad time. Beat him up! Oh, wait. I have to pull the trigger? That's kinda fucked up. Yeah, sure, why not? Is that what you wanted? Is that what you had in mind? You Nazi asshole. Cause that's all you're getting. Oh, well, so much for the acting guy. It's mehr als perfect. Let me help you unpack, Mr. Redfield. Yeah, maybe you shouldn't. Okay. Brace yourself, Adolf. I'm leaving here with your secret Odin codes. Then we steal the Ausmerzer, take out General Angle, and show the American people what revolution looks like. Yeah, that guy shouldn't have offered to, uh... Unpack my stuff. Look at this. Welcome to Venus, Mr. Redfield. 